Riot have posted their new champion roadmap, and I just want to quickly go through what was mentioned. I must preface this with all of this is my personal speculation. Firstly, the new Void Jungler. Riot have teased what I assume is a segment of her splash art. As for what Riot have said, it sounds like she's going to be a real tower taker and have some form of essence mechanic where she can transform. Not much else was said other than she's coming soon. Next is the non-traditional bot lane carry. The main takeaway here is the mist. To me, the mist sounds like an AoE ability that you will want to fight within. Other than that, there isn't too much other than the image of the bar fight where we can see colorful slashes on the wall. Based on what was said in the season 2022 opening day video, her weapon is going to be a whip of some variety. Which if we look at the original imagery they teased in that video, I'm not sure if the whips are these watery hands and we just have to wait to find out. Next is a little segment on the Uja visual update. Mainly a preview with what direction they're going in with the ultimate skin, Spirit Guard. They want to basically keep it the same while cranking it up to 11 and Riot shows us a rough early model preview. But now onto something new, CG use. Comprehensive gameplay updates. CGU is to update gameplay for two types of champions, those that have high quality art and narrative but whose gameplay just doesn't quite deliver on their fantasies, or champions with more complicated gameplay issues that can't be solved by changing one or two abilities. Aurelian Sol is the first champion to receive one of these updates, and they'll be rebuilding his kit from scratch while keeping the same model, theme, and narrative. Riot go on to say that they're currently targeting the end of the year for ASOL's update, so there's still quite a little bit of time before we actually see it. And obviously, it can easily just slide into next year if they get behind on it. And Riot say if the results look good, then they'll consider giving more champions CGUs. Moving on to the Skarna VGU, we've got some exploration concepts for Skarna. The first two rows are attempts to keep Skarna's theme pretty much the same. The third row contains explorations of a full reboot of the Bracken. And the last row is an exploration of a version of Skarna where his current lore is continued. As always, this is early concept art. They might not use any of it, but it's nice to see what direction Riot are thinking of going in. And lastly, the outro. Riot show this beautiful image of a region of Shurima that hasn't been seen yet. In the next roadmap, Riot will be covering the Pride of Nazuma, a high skill top lane tank. Now, the last roadmap came out in September, so expect at least six months till the next one. Anyway, I've linked the roadmap in the description if you wish to give it a full read yourself. Anyway, that's everything from me. I'll catch you in the next one.